Hi, so this is my very first video. So please be kind. If you like what you see, please uh, hit the like button and you know subscribe. Today, I am just doing a very quick comparison on Daniel Smith's um, Extra Fine Watercolors in, let's see, Iridescent Garnet and Iridescent Ruby. Um, oh, let me do it this way. Iridescent Ruby and Iridescent Garnet. Um, I bought these because I, I love Daniel Smith watercolors. Um, but I have been using these by um, Artistic Isle. I got the travel size because I never bought handmade watercolors before. And I have to say, Artistic Isle wins. This is the Iridescent Ruby. Um, this is Canson XL watercolor paper um, that my son had uh, dabbled on. So it's, I mean, it's beautiful. I'm just picking a little camera. It's beautiful. Um, Daniel Smith's iridescent, iridescent Garnet. And now this is the Iridescent Lyle. Whatever that other color was. The Iridescent Ruby. Oh, here's Iridescent Ruby. I'm using a Princeton Heritage brush, size 6. Um, and it's really, really pretty. But I am now going to use Artistic Eye. Uh, let me get out my little card. I'm going to be using first the Italian Rose. I'm going to put it right next to Smith. Look how beautiful this is. So iridescent, so metallic. It is absolutely gorgeous. Um, it just, I can't get over these handmade watercolors. The next one I'm going to do is Spiced Cider. Um, which I think is really close to the iridescent garnet. I mean, this is just simply uh, gorgeous watercolors. And then the last one I'm going to do is, it's kind of like a copper. It's one of my favorites. It's called a deep red. I'm going to put it on this side. And it's more like a copper. It's just so beautiful. I cannot recommend Artistic Isles watercolors enough. Um, she did send me uh, two regular, not iridescent colors. This one's the phthalo blue. I'm just gonna put it down so you can see what it looks like. <sighs> and the other one is um, magnesia, manganese, violet. I don't know if it's one of her violet colors, but. So if you are looking for an iridescent or a metallic watercolor, I highly recommend Artistic Isle. Um, here I can maybe turn it around, sorry. Um, and it's her watercolors are just amazing. So thank you for watching and hopefully there will be more videos coming. Thanks.